feeding time world headquarters garage aquatics 2023 this is that little beta spawn that i've got not so little is it they're getting big they are gorgeous little fish there's about 30 of them in here and i dropped a couple of these algae wafers in and they love those and so do all the little quarries the little bronze quarries and there's about 30 of them also kind of cool they all play really well there's one this one right up front that one this tail fin's getting nipped i was going to take it out and then i should realize they should probably figure out who's doing it and take that one out but mostly they play real well they're fun to watch they are just really growing up beautifully i don't know what i'm gonna do with them all i'm gonna have to do some serious sorting at some point yeah i do like these uh algae wafers there's one bottom left corner and one right in front of that plecosaurus's face it brings them all out in this tank brings out the plecos it brings out the pandacories the guppies love it and so do the blue dream shrimp they just go nuts for this good food maynard so this is the orange sun, sun kiss tank and they really seem to like it as well so that's the whole idea with this is just bring them forward I get these uh, algae wafers, got them from Amazon. I see that they have them on eBay too. Uh, I will leave a link because I like these. So the guppies in this tank, you know, I'm not sure if uh, they can take it or leave it, but you know what, that's okay. Um, it's really all about the shrimp. Make sure they're, they're well fed. And I've gotten, we can't see because the algae wafers fell behind that plastic log, but there's red red cherries coming out in this tank. And I'm gonna shoot back across the orange sun kiss and the blue dream. And there's more red cherries in this tank and they just go nuts. Fish like them too. Here, we'll just spit across. And the, uh, the Mickey Mouse platies. They've been feeding off it, and there's a little, little uh, bronze quarry feeding off of it. And there's a load of little baby Mickey Mouse platies in this tank. And they'll go nuts for this stuff. They really enjoy it. So this is the Crebensis tank. I dropped three wafers in here. Uh, it doesn't take much for these guys. They're, they're gone. They were just right in the front. Um, so as soon as they start softening them up a little bit from the water, they, they just, they're gone. And in this tank, there's uh, bronze quarries down there. I dropped three in this tank. And the angels were here, but the angels spooked when they came along. But they, they followed it down also, and they were eating on these. The angel fish love it. And here's uh, the cowards of the fish room. The little, uh, uh, um, albino core, oh, geez, the little albino uh, crebensis. And I dropped three in here, and nobody's home right now. There's some little stir by quarries in here too. Uh, and they're all a bunch of little cowards, so as soon as I go away, they'll be back feeding on these. And then I dropped three in the guppy tank, and you can tell how much the guppies absolutely hate these wafers. Do not like them at all. And there's uh, a couple peppered quarries in here, uh, and there's some blue dream shrimp in here. I, I moved some in, and they did not do real well. I was really, really kind of disappointed. There's only a couple left. And I think there's one hiding right there, that dark spot right back in there. That's one of the blue dreams. And there, there's, there were three Amano shrimp in here. I just saw one, so I don't know. But that, yeah, look at the guppies go for this stuff. They are absolutely insane. So I'm going to have to run guppies on, uh, on uh, my store and my eBay channel. Um, and I'll probably do them, you know, like buy 10 and they'll be mixed they'll be fry essentially um there won't be any specific selection now oh, here come the pepper quarries. there goes one and there is the other one and we'll figure out a price uh, i'll try and do them really uh really fair so that way uh you guys can get some of these little uh uh fancies if you if you'd like and here uh i put three of the wafers in here they're gone they were all back in the corner. So between the plecosauruses 
and uh, the sword tails. I don't know if the poor little Cory's ever got, that's the problem with a tank like this. You gotta make sure the Cory's get fed. There's always stuff on the bottom of the tank for them to, to go through, but you wanna make sure the Cory's get fed. And that, that kind of comes to overfeeding the rest of these knuckleheads because they're just little piglets. Neon orange sword tails, and I've got all males. And I think I'm gonna put some of these up too. And then in this tank, the false Julies, I put three in this tank also, and the false Julies go for them. Uh, there's uh, the albino crebensis parents are in here, and there's a couple uh, juveniles in here, and then the red cherries will go for them too. So all in all, let me show you the label. Uh, aquatic foods, and again, uh, I think this was a half pound pack. And this last time I just ordered a two and a half pound pack from uh, Amazon. So there's the, the, you could probably shoot it off the screen if you want. The Amazon code is on the left and you know, hit the pause button and the eBay codes on the right, the QR codes.